tell me about what was the origin. How did you and your, your man Randy come up with saying that, you know, this is what we want to do? Where did that come from? Right. So, you know, me being a big community person, um, everything that I do has to evolve and revolve around community issues and what we're doing. So, you know, when I was thinking about getting started, I didn't know what business, you know, I wanted to start. But I knew we had it to our group is called Creative Group Economics. So we wanted to just not talk it, but show it. Right. So our way of doing Creative Group Economics, we needed to start a business and use our community funds and all of us put together our money in order to create something greater. So uh, just looking for an industry to do. Um, actually, my partner Randy, he he just invited me some at his house, and he had about four or five, you know, beauty supply owners already there. And at this point in time, we never thought about starting a beauty supply store. We were just thinking about, well, I was just thinking about what type of businesses that we can start that play the community. Um, I couldn't start no food because I don't know how to cook. Um, I never worked in a restaurant, so I didn't know nothing about grease traps and all the stuff that plague, and I didn't want to deal with the health department. So... <laughs> So uh, thinking about that, we were like, what is another industry that's heavily exploited, you know, in the black community? And that was the beauty hair care space. Um, it's by him inviting me to that meeting, it just kind of woke me up. I didn't know anything about beauty supply, anything. I just know business, uh, formations, you know, partnerships. Um, and so when we presented it to, to Randy, he's, he's rattling off all these ideas. Um, and I'm like, yeah, we partners. Um, and it was kind of, <laughs> <laughs> it was it was there from then. So, you know, he took a lot of time and he dabbled in know all of the inventory and stuff, ins and outs. So, you know, and my role was pretty much finding out how can we keep this business going, how much money we need to raise. Um, and so we raised 100000 just using a PowerPoint. Mm -hmm. um, and so we, you know, found creative ways to raise re revenue outside of credit, outside of collateral. Um, couldn't because we just couldn't use it. We couldn't go those avenues, so we had to be a little bit more creative with how we raise funds. That's dope. So, so, all that's your sports and news and entertainment, this relentless game. game. Hey, hey, bitch on game.